Hey guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video we're going to be doing the knee deep task. So, I've just, does that work? It's like a little plow. I could plow the rocks out like that maybe. You have to do it in reverse I guess, but um, let's attach a winch. Let's do it to this point. Um, Ooh, it's starting to ride off to the side already. Um, how do I uh, control this? Move it. What am I doing? Oh, the ramp. I guess I can't even uh, control where that thing goes on this one. It's a little bit off to the side, but it'll have to do. Let's, uh, let's move it. Which side did I grab? Oh, there we go. There. Okay. So as I was saying, I'm not sure because I think I, I'm pretty sure I moved this truck like a long, long time ago when I played this phase before. Ooh, nice. It lets me bring it all the way up. I may not have, but I'm pretty sure I drug it to this point. Whoa! So, if you're wondering why my truck's here, that's probably why. I, I'm pretty sure I moved it, but it's been so long that I don't, don't remember. But, as you can see, this is a quite a swampy area in here. And I'm not a big fan of how the uh, front end of this 732 and Zero sticks out so far. It tends to hit the ground a lot, but overall it's a very good truck. Um, just in the last few videos I was saying how I basically haven't used any of these ramped towing platforms or towing platforms or whatever they're, they're all called. Um, they've been in the game for a long time and I've never used them. I've always just pulled trucks. So I thought it'd be kind of fun to do a couple of videos with some of these and actually, you know, use the uh, towing platform. So we got this guy up on here. Wait, is it? I thought it was on for a second. It like its lights were on. I'm not going to fill up on fuel. I don't... Wait, what are we stuck on now? Oh, there's a big rock under us. Nice. There we go. Um, I used to have the fuel truck right up on the, the uh, train tracks up here, but I ended up flipping that Boron 43233, I think it was, and so I had to drive it just a little bit forward to flip that back over. And we do have another fuel truck, the Cat 770G, which is... Wait, where's the motor pool? I don't remember where that is now. I remember checking before I started. I think it's by the farm. Or it's in that farm area. I could be wrong, but... Um, whoa. But I'm pretty sure it's in that farm area, and... Uh, that's where we're headed. We have a it's Cat 770G there with some fuel if we do need that, but I think we should be fine without it. This truck isn't uh, completely centered, but it's, it's decently centered. Uh, I think this is the Zixi... Oh, it says in the top right, 5368. That's one of the trucks that I've, I've only used like one time. I'm pretty sure I used it and I was like, wow, this thing sucks, and then I never used it again. But that was a long time ago. That was uh, probably almost... Pretty much right as the game came out, like a month or two afterwards, and uh, I might not have even had all the upgrades at the time. I don't, I don't know if I did, because this was uh, back when I played it on Xbox. So maybe the truck has improved since then. But I remember I tried it once, and I was just like, "Geez, this thing's terrible." So I'll, I'll have to give it another try, because I'm trying to use some other vehicles. Uh, make sure that I use all of them. 
both to switch things up, but also to see uh, which ones are good and which ones are not good. But I've watched a lot of videos of comparisons of it, uh, trucks, and I don't recall seeing that one in many videos. So maybe it's just uh, so bad that people are just like, nope, doesn't even need a comparison, it's just bad. I'm not sure. Maybe I'm just not looking for those videos, too. Maybe I'm just looking at the better ones, and uh, that one's not in the better truck, so it's not in there. I don't know. Alright. Everything's going uh, well so far. I just noticed now that it has the drop point up in front of us here, so yeah, it looks like it's pretty much at the farm. That's, uh, this road goes up and to the left here, and then it's kind of towards that farm. It goes back down. We do have some chained tires on this thing. I usually use mud tires, but since we're in a snowy area, I figured I'd throw these on. I didn't, didn't know if there was going to be any ice that we would, uh, need them for on the way there or back, but now that I've drove all the way there and pretty much all the way back, I don't think we needed chains, but who knows? Maybe the chains are a little better in the snow. I just thought about it. It's kind of weird that they don't have a snow, like, stat, if that makes sense, like, area. Like, they have the highway, they have off-road, they have um, ice and they have mud, but this is snow runner. Why don't they have a snow one? But yeah, uh, it looks like this is definitely in the farm area. Because it looks like the drop points just appear to the left. So let's uh, get that dropped off. I could probably bring that trailer back on my way back as well. There we go. 3400 for that. Thank you guys for watching. If you want to watch another video, there's a random video on screen and another playlist. Please be sure to share the video, like it, comment, and subscribe. Turn on those bell notifications so you're notified when I upload. And until next time, peace.